Alright, hey everyone, Wonderbot here, and welcome back to, I guess, sort of the finale of Antihero. So I don't have, um, I don't have multiply, uh, multiplayer lined up. I'm not even sure if you can. Huh. There's some interesting mutators here. Um. Oh, create an account. Ugh. Uh, yeah, I don't have anybody lined up for multiplayer, and I, I'm not entirely sure if I, I will. I might end up suggesting to this to, like, Bird or Keith or both or something like that, but that'll be later. Uh, so, for now, this will be the, the finale, and I guess any multiplayer I play with this game will be a separate series labeled as such. So, I guess keep tuned to that whenever that happens, but for now, let's go kick Hyde's ass. So, Emma unites the guild. Hyde makes a final stand. Assemble your crew. Sharpen your shivs. Dress up for the occasion. This ends tonight. And this is just a... No. Hyde is, ever... is coming at you with everything he has. He gets a free victory point every few turns. Normal victory points do not count towards your victory. You must kill Hyde to win. Oh. Okay, well, for starters, let's get Widow's Bottom. Let's get cooking. Please. Okay. Right away. I think the price is slightly higher than normal. Locked in. Well, we'll get a gang next turn. Okay, so he gets a victory point every couple of turns. This is kind of the anti-me round, but uh, should be fine. Oh, he's just right there. This might actually be easier than I thought, so we just have an assassination contract for Hyde. Pretty standard stuff. Can't get Lamplighter, would like to. Could get Scout. We'll get Scout. Uh we need that sooner than later, because if we can if we can If we can find his gangs and kill them. It'll be mine. Before he can even do anything. Sure. All we have to do is hit him a couple of times and he goes down. Yeah. Okay. So we have... Let's get Lamplighter. We're going to need that. Free resources are an incredibly rare resource. Yar. Har. Okay. And if I remember right, he gets urchins at a discount. Now my gang might be... In trouble here, yeah. That's it. Went down. Um. On my way. All right. On it. I'll check out Urchin Alley, which is an estate. Interesting. Well, we're gonna stab his gang, and that's the extent of what I can do. We'll kill him on the next turn. I was hoping he wouldn't be able to kill my gang with his. But he probably comes paired with a bonus. So there he is. There his gang is. Gonna kill it. Bankrupt him slowly. Okay. Hello. Right away. Yeah, so he, he comes pre-upgraded. Um, let's get the extra gold. I'm here. Of course. I'm just gonna hit him. Start moving towards taking him out. Okay. He did not go for my gang. Unfortunately, that puts us in a bit of an awkward spot. Because he's actively blocking me in. It'll be mine. This is, is kind of obnoxious. Oh. 
Okay. I'm gonna just keep stabbing him. Let's go. So we'll kill him next round if he doesn't kill mine. Um Let's get expert scout, because we probably need that. Let's go for people. Another for my pocket. It's another estate. A lot of estates. Fortunately, nothing to chuck my urchins into. But yeah, if I can get two gangs. If I can get two gangs. Oh, he's starting to. Huh? He's got. If I can get uh, two gangs with high attack power controlling the environment. There he goes. Do we get. Okay, he's been wounded. And we do get an upgrade for that awesome damage. Okay, next after that. Gotta go for the trading house. Christ. And he's got a bank. Figured as much. Okay. And then I'm gonna stab the guy here. Nothing else I can do, though. Unfortunately, since he gets free... Actions. I mean, really, my best and strongest option here is to kill him repeatedly. He's got seven HP. Jesus Christ. Okay. I'm here. Let's go. Probably should just start evicting from the bank, but no, we'll get a truant officer. Um Yeah, main problem is I don't have any businesses of my own. I guess we should probably head for a Tickletail Inn. I've been scouting out his. But what I should probably do is scout out mine. We might lose this one. Just owing the fact that he gets Tons of free urchins. I'm also stuck here now. It'll be morning. Well, uh, what can I afford? I can't afford the poison blade. Or we could save up for the second gang. Let's save up for the second gang. Um... I guess we'll just take lanterns. Okay, so let's just stab him for two. Let's go. I'm just gonna go for his little his dude. Uh we've got damage. He's probably got his own gang hiding somewhere, which sucks, because I'm gonna lose mine. Well. If we're lucky, we'll be Oh, Okay. We are okay. Okay. So we've gotten that. We need eviction. Okay. And we need a second gang. Because, yeah, he doesn't generally go for the second gang. Giving me a huge bonus here. Next round, we will get the... Uh, Okay, he already got he got the gets. Another for my pocket. Ah, it's an orphanage. It'll be mine. And it's maxed. Cripes. It'll be mine. I'll check out Lesser Twin. It's an estate. For me. It'll be mine. And we'll check out the Solemn Mutter. He could win if I'm not careful here, which is really scary. I'd like to take the tickle tail uh, in, but I can't. Well, that's okay. I mean, again, all I have to do is... Jesus Christ. Okay, uh, let's try that again. Okay, so this time around, I'm not going to be as aggressive at controlling him. I can't. I can't do that. That screwed me over. Oh, 
shoot. Um, let's try that again. He got three victory points in one run. The fact that he just automatically gets victory points on top of having a huge bonus is uh, infuriating. But yeah, there we... Uh, We just couldn't. Okay, um... So we need cooking. Let's go. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can build my base. Uh, instead of trying to aggressively control who and where. Okay, so we've got the church. Getting to the church sucks. But if we can get, uh get to the church, that'll help. I just can't do much with it. Yeah, RNG more or less just threw him straight into the top. That last round. I'm trying. I w the click detection feels like it's been hampered this time around. Okay, so this will get us an income. Which I'm kind of desperate for. And we'll get lamplighter. Okay, nothing else I can do. After, after this, we need to start training up our gang. Let's check out the nuns. Bank. And accessible. Hello. Yeah, getting getting a bank is incredible in and of, in of itself. Okay. Um is it all? Yeah, I'll just scout that out. Okay, so we wanna we wanna gang. And we wanna start murdering sure. these like little guys. Unfortunately, I'm probably just going to randomly lose my gang here, which I'm going to be kind of pissy about. But I don't have anything better to do. Because, yeah, I think last time, me losing my gang uh, was crippling. This time around, can make it work. Okay. See, so yeah, I'm just gonna kill all the thugs in my general area before I go after him. I wish almost that it was one of those that when you, uh, when you wound hide, he's, like, downed for, uh... He's down for, like, an actually considerable amount of time. Okay. I'm gonna get Art Critic. I'd like to get Dagger. We'll have to get that on the next one. Okay. So I've got enough that we can get... That we can get the bank. That'll... That'll help. So much. Because, yeah, last time I didn't... I didn't have any any structures. I was just trying to take his, but since he just spits urchins out the moment he discovers this structure. Oh. Yeah. Took too many actions. Okay, can't see anything. Uh. Let's go. I'm gonna go for the art first. Okay, he's already got an assassination be under his belt. That's a problem. <laughs> I'm gonna just start killing these guys. Um. What? Close. Okay, I have no more money. And he just gets a random baseline victory point. This is brutal. Um, okay, so I still have mine. 
Uh, I want Safecracker, but I think we need Brewing. Because if I'm going after him, I need to kill his gang first. And I need to be able to survive two hits. Okay, so let's check. Found his gang. And I got the damage for it. Perfect. Okay, another estate. Interesting. Okay, so for starters, gonna kill his gang. Let's go evictions. Unfortunately, because he's been kind of unmolested, he gets tons of upgrades here. That I don't get. Um. It'll be mine. And I can't. I could get reinforced steel. I mean, again, all we need to do is kill him. The problem is my gang surviving long enough to do so is the hard part. I guess if I hire assassins. Wait, he can. He can. Goddamn. I just realized this. He can evict people. On his own. Oh, that's really annoying. Okay, so he's got a church over there. I'm just gonna go kill him. Okay, so we gotta get safe cracker. Okay. Gonna get a thug, toss him into my gang. Hello. Gonna get an urchin. Toss him into my church. Expensive. But yeah, I, I feel like, um... I feel like, specifically, whenever you down him, it should actually, uh... It should actually, like, stun him for a little while. Uh... Or, like, cost him something. Because, yeah, the fact that he can just... Spit urchins is... Actually a serious problem. Okay, well, let's get gold per kill. Unfortunately, no amount of gold is going to solve my problems here. Well, no, it will. Oh. That surprised the hell out of me. Oh, and I still can't get a second gang. We need lanterns. Oh, getting an extra... Oh, he went after my trading house. I didn't even notice. Or did I never fin it, fill it out? I have no idea. Well, that sucks. Um, honestly, I guess I'm just going to keep armoring my, my own gang. I have money. And we'll have another gang on the next turn. I'd like to get a truant officer. But having a gang that I can specifically hound and hurt hide with would be important. It'd be nice if there was, like, a timer that I could see. He killed my gang. I'm more than a little pissed off. Hello, mate. It'll be mine. Trying to think. How do we do this? Let's go. I guess I'm gonna start by getting rid of one of his urchins. From there. Okay, we need damage. Evictions would be nice, but I, I think I'm gonna want a truant oh, yeah. officer for that specifically. Oh. He's got a gang somewhere around here too. No, I I killed his gang. He probably still has one around. But now I've got two. Okay. I just wish I had something I could throw my urchins into. Okay. Yeah, he he must have gotten an assassin along the way there. But yeah, since his HP keeps going up and he can assassin uh, assassinate my own. Uh, we're gonna have issues. Okay. We got the second gang. Yeah. Um. 
Emma. I was really hoping I could get reinforced steel. Let's go. No! You're not the one I selected. Balls. Let's go. Well, we don't have any anything else. No, we have the turned ankle. Another for my pocket. It's a trading house. Okay, that's actually really helpful. And I guess I'll scout the prickle back. All right. That gives us something useful. Or would have. Okay, um. So can't see him. He's got another assassin uh, assassination contract. I'm gonna lose this one again. Bad luck and assassination screwed me. Let's go. I mean, if I can hit him. If I can find him and hit him next round, we're good. Maybe. But he's he's got a gang lurking somewhere. Yeah, I feel like... Yep, he just gets his church. God. This is... This game went from, um... On my way. This game went from, you know, fairly reasonable. Uh... To downright impossible in like no time flat. Okay, so we've got to get cooking. We need these urchins. We don't get those urchins, we're doomed. This. I might. I don't know. I might not be able to do this. Okay, let's see if we get uh, lucky with the liar's roost. It's a church and it's available this time around. Thank you. Okay, and let's scout this. Okay, so we need a gang to murder this guy. We'll go damage for better or worse. Hello. Right away. Yeah, this is kind of brutal. It seems winnable, but the fact that Hyde gets um, a victory point every five turns, on top of collecting them himself, is frustrating. Uh, because, I mean, yes, I only have to kill him three times, but the problem is he can actively kill my only damage-dealing source largely without trouble, uh, and that's really problematic, uh... Is it all? Okay, so we've got an estate, which is not really what I wanted, and an orphanage, which is really good. Okay, so we want to get Scout. And we want to go Scout this. You want to go kill him. Okay, I'm just going to keep pumping damage. Unfortunately, I can't afford an orphan, an urchin on this round. But either way, we can get the orphanage. If I can max out the orphanage, that might help. Okay, uh, Hello. for starters, Pulse. toss him in there. That'll make life easier, generally. What's that? Another for my pocket? We're still pretty poor. It'll be mine. It'll be mine. Yep. Okay, so we found a strange fellow's club. Not really sure about that one, but yeah, let's kill the guy here. Maybe I should just get gold per kill. Okay, we want lamp lighter. Okay, and... Boy. I'm gonna right, toss eh? him into the trading house. We need tech. Okay. Yeah, maybe going the second gang uh, is a bad idea. Maybe I should go for a truant officer. Okay, let's just accept this for the time being. Uh, what do we have available? On my way. 
I mean, the more of these that I can just take for myself, the better. I'm trying to think. I'm not going to reveal my gang yet. I'm just going to kill this guy. Sure. Okay. I gotta remember he goes for assassination contracts too. Okay, cool. So now we can one shot hide and he's probably not within range. Okay, so we wanna chuck him into the underbottom. And we wanna chuck this other one into the trading house. Having that orphanage is going to save us an extremely large amount of trouble, sort of. Because if I can actually just kind of take the city, usually I win based on, um... <clears throat> usually I can manage to win in these situations based on, uh, On controlling locations, and if I can manage that... Okay, he's shown up with his. Luckily I do four damage. Unfortunately... Uh, let's just do gold per kill. We're gonna need the gold. Unfortunately, can't get the truant officer, and I'm gonna have to start maybe going for thugs. We're gonna want him anyway, uh, because if I can bolster him early, that guy, them, them early, it'll make life easier. Church. I'm just hoping I can actually, uh, control. How did I... What? Right away. I... I can't get over there, can I? The heck? How'd that happen? I have no idea. Okay. Well, I'm control. I'm in control of more of the city now. Okay. So let's take the passages. Yeah, I'd like to kill him. But if I can actually uh if I, I if I can actually take and keep these structures. Okay, so that's an estate. Cause yeah, he's not particularly aggressive about evictions yet. And he will be, but not yet. So that means Colder Luxford is probably Of course. A uh that probably means Colder Luxford is a uh, is a bank. Oh. Let's get another one of these guys, and I should be able to afford the truant officer. But let's do that on the next. Uh, let's get dagger. Ideally, if we can have it, so okay, she can. Uh, If we can have it that she can also help stab, hide, that'll make my life easier. Okay, so this might have been a financial uh, mistake, but I figure this way, barring throwing an assassin at me, he probably won't be able to take my gang down, and all future gangs will start beefier. But yeah, next next round I'm going to try and reach Colder Luxford and a victim. Okay. Shiny? Yep, bank. On my way. Motherfucker. Okay, I'm gonna do something a bit different. Suck it. Of course. This way. Pricey as hell. But it's mine now. Off we go. Oh, that's an achievement. Right this way, children. Yeah, you can decoy, sort of. Uh you can still get into a building if you want to. Just take some effort. Okay, so at this point I've taken his income out. And I've got the whole city under my thumb. Obviously, he's still a super big danger, but, uh... I'm in a much better spot. We're gonna have to find his gang, 
and kill his gang, and we're going to have to start killing him too. Okay, well... Let's get reinforced steel. Kill the thug. It'll be mine. Yeah. Kill Hyde. Or injured Hyde. Okay, he did get an assassination contract, so he does have a gang out there. That's fine. Okay. Is it all? That's not it. Uh There's his gang. Oh, jeez, that's a painful gang. Um, I have an option. I have some options. They are all crazy person talk. Okay, so I'm okay. gonna put a thug there. I'm gonna put a thug okay. right there. Okay, so that blocks his gang, his gang in. His gang can't move. Uh, and then I'm probably going to save my money because I'm kind of poor. Okay, yeah, so this way his gang should not be able to move free. So even if he does attack my, um, even if he does attack my own gang, he's only going to be able to do two damage to it, which is manageable. Oops. He didn't even try. Uh -huh. Okay. Which is super helpful, because now we can just kill. Now, can I reach? Okay, so that guy's in the way. We have too many impediments. Um. It'll be mine. In my pocket. But I do have an option. I do have options. Okay, so I'm just gonna Let's kill the go. thug. Yeah, he's gonna get another point in a turn. Uh, which kind of sucks. So let's get safe cracker. Okay. So now that she's free, we're gonna get all the way around. Takes her turn. Okay, so we're gonna do the same thing. I'm gonna bankrupt him just so I can take his uh, trading house. I wish that wouldn't take all of Emma's actions. Oh well, that was pricey. Worth it, pricey. Oh, he did actually attack my my gang. Now that I'm looking at it, well, all I have to do is kill him. Okay, yeah, he's hitting me. He's hitting me hard. So I'm gonna get Poison Blade. We're gonna stab him. Because I need more money. Okay, so we've wounded him again. But yeah, we needed that cash. Because if he takes up my gang, I am very much in trouble here. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so that's a little bit of money. That's not quite what I was looking quite what I was looking for, but that's fine. Um On my way. In my pocket. Okay. That's the cash I was looking for. I'm gonna toss okay. him in here. Cause at this point all I have to do is find and murder him one more time and then we win. And by that merit, he needs to live. So unless he hires an assassin and kills it. Oh, if he does that word very much in trouble. I just know this is my best shot. Okay. He killed it. Ah, you son of a... Oh. He's actually got less HP. Still sucks. Okay. I'm here. 
Let's go. Just trying to think. Um. Morning. I guess I can hire an assassin as long as he doesn't win this turn. We're good. Could he escape? I'm gonna try something. Something else. Um... I'm going to bolster his HP a little bit. Okay. I don't see him killing the next assassination contract, and he won't get another point for, like, four turns-ish. Okay, we'll be able to get the assassin next turn. Okay, perfect. Yeah. I screwed up. Let's go. But I didn't screw up. I got Master Scout, not Assassin. But yeah, he was locked in. He couldn't go anywhere. Oh, that was tense. I almost screwed it up so bad, I would have been so pissed. But he found he was no longer keen for the thief's life. Outlaws don't get old. They retire, or are done in. And Lightfinger preferred to quit while he was ahead. Left the underworld a rich and satisfied man. And anointed Emma, the guild's new master thief. Now the most powerful rogue in the city, Emma threw open her doors to the city's urchins, who flocked to the guild, eager for her tutelage. They prospered, and all was normal. For a time, Emma soon found new adventures. Or rather, they found her. But that, my friends, is another story for another time. Yay! I can now use Hyde's avatar and I've beaten the game. This was really fun. This was really fun. Oh. Oh no, that's full screen. Okay, that's just window side. Yeah, so I guess uh, seeing as we're here, we as well look at this seeing as there weren't regular credits. Uh, credits, credits. the crowd choose if we have got the mind to. Wow, this is a this is a credit song. Anyway, thanks Tim Conkling for uh, making this game and sending it to me. I think indirectly, but still, this is really fun, and I I enjoyed playing a, a board game thing. That last mission though was mean. But we got it, and that's all that matters. So thanks for watching, everybody, and I'll see you guys next time. And like I was saying at the beginning of the episode, I don't know when multiplayer is going to come, if it's even going to come, uh, but I I hope you guys enjoyed me playing through this solo. So, like, like I said earlier, thanks for watching. See you guys next time.